Well, I just wanted to. I mean, you. I heard you mention yeah. that that when Snelling was closed at, at yep. over I ninety four, even for how long was it? A, a week or yeah, so? Yeah, I think it was about a week. It, it created some headaches, right? Yeah, yeah. There was a lot of traffic, especially on on the Selby Snelling intersection with Ide Mill Road. Yeah. Is that around where you live? Or? Yeah, I live just on Dayton, in between uh, Fairview and Snelling. So, so what were people doing? They were. But it was really, and just recently, it's that intersection. People coming up Ide Mill Road and getting onto Selby and taking a right on Snelling, yeah. trying to get to 94, it gets all backed up. Okay. And so my concern with this construction is for three months, what's going to happen with that traffic as they try and um, get on the 94 from 35E? That's right. Because they're closing the bridge at Snelling and 94, yep. or this bridge over I-94 for three months. And uh, that's going to make your life hairy. Yeah, it's going well, to add a lot, and there's going to be a lot of traffic in and around that neighborhood with the vintage construction. Anyways, it's already kind of backed up. And then I just learned tonight that they're going to have the ramp onto 